My name is Rapsy. Welcome back to Into the Gungeon. Ooh, 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 I did not check. <laughs> Whatever the streak said, I, I didn't check. That's... Oops. God damn it. <laughs> I, I always say at the end of the episode where I'm trying to tabulate the skill. Uh, oh, yeah, no, I uh, I'm gonna check uh, what the, what the, what the streak is at. Nope, never check. It's around 10, somewhere around there. Let's just assume it is 10, for safety's sake. It's definitely very close to that. Okay, now it's just you. You don't get this room often. So I should savor it when I do. That said, it's also not, you know... Really a remarkable room in any way, shape, or form. Every single time I miss a shot right now, I'm feeling really bad, because I'm still in the mindset of it only costs ammo if I miss a shot from the Hyperlight Blaster I had last episode. Ooh, what are you? What are you? Yeah. Kind of wish you'd stayed anonymous. Against the Gunniva Convention! Oh, adorable. Wait a second. I can keep you at range more easily with this, in fact. Beautiful. Let's find ourselves our boss room as soon as we can. There's no boss I don't feel confident killing with the base weapons here. Uh, except for obviously Doorlord, but I don't think Doorlord can appear on the first floor. Plus, I had Doorlord last run. It won't appear this run. I know I'm tempting fate having said that now. Okay. Now we can swap back to the crossbow, yay! I just didn't want to waste crossbow shots because I don't know when I'm next going to get ammunition for the crossbow. Could easily be after the boss. By which point it might be too late. So I'm trying to conserve as much as I can afford to. Only if I can afford to conserve comfortably am I doing it. Beautiful. It's only really the ghost rounds that I care about taking out. Rubidine key. Okay. Double key, in fact. Uh, if we get fuck all from this floor, we can easily just go down to the oubliette as a result of that. Double key, we can afford both of them. If we get one more key drop, or if you have... Or if we, sorry, have a chest that we don't want to open. Hollow chest we don't want to open. Then we won't really be hamstrung by going down to the oubliette. Awesome. May as well open the entrance now. Let's check for secret rooms. There you are, all the way back down there. I'll be coming for you soon, buddy. Don't you worry. Okay. This is the worst fight we could have gotten, and it's still fine. Beautiful. This is why I saved as many crossbow rounds as I possibly could as well. Because if I was using the basic pistol against that early phase, we would have been in a lot more danger. But we weren't. Easily done. 
Okay, D-pad, fine. Oh, D-pad. <gasps> D-pad. I can use it for stealing, of course. Just making sure. D-pad might be an important weapon, so I'll hold off on using it. But if I deem it necessary, I can use it to steal. Uh, I've been told you can use a grappling hook to steal. By the way, D-pad has the ability to use a grappling hook. That's how you use it to steal. I've been told you can use the grappling hook to steal as long as you launch the steal from outside of the room. But still... Uh, ooh, wow, we don't want either of these chests. Whew, damn. That's really rare to get ammo from that. No offing? Ooh, I don't mind if I do. That's actually pretty damn good right there, right there. And we're going down to the oubliette at this rate for definitely certain. Okay, come back here. Take both of the keys. Just blank there in case. And let's go. <laughs> Wrong way. Let's go this way instead. Uh, I really wish Patches and Many would give you something if you had full health. Just because for an NPC to have no effect in your run, considering how relatively rare NPCs are... Eh, feels a bit bad, man. You're kidding me, right? It was in the perfect position and not be here. I think what I do here is I actually just use... Crossbow normally as I would be for clearing this floor. Uh, and then I swap over only in really... Really special cases where I know it's going to be... I can't believe I didn't take damage there. I should have, don't get me wrong. Which is why I can't believe I didn't. Okay. Um. Can the Pupulon stop? Just stop, please, Poopulon. You're doing too much annoying shit, and you don't die to the fire I keep putting down. Fuck. If I steal from you and you notice me, will you disappear? Let me check the stealing mechanic. If you're caught stealing by a merchant, the specific merchant will be... What? Will be open if encountered in a different location or floor. So I want to buy lead skin, I want to steal compressed air tank, and I want to buy Master of Unlocking. Okay, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to set myself up to try and steal that and then run away. 
So if you leave the room before the item is stolen, my understanding is you don't get caught. <laughs> it worked! <laughs> Can I go back in or is he gonna get mad at me? Mm, it fucking worked! <laughs> That's so good. Uh, now I'll take that. I'll steal that. He gets mad. He's gonna teleport away. But it doesn't fucking matter. I got everything. <laughs> Holy shit. Oh my god! That is... so cool! Thank you, Chris! Uh... Chris Bowden, I believe. That was good, good info. Nothing but that primo info right there. And it got us some real good stuff as well. <laughs> uh, there should never be a chest in this run that I can't afford to open. <gasps> cursed bullets! I already have two levels of curse from having stolen twice. And then I've got one more level of curse for cursed bullets. So that's a 30% damage. Oh. Um, do I need to force? Yeah, I still need a room clear weapon. I'm gonna need to force web. I can't force weapons. I already took the. Of course. Never mind. Master of Unlocking means I'm never gonna want for keys. I will always have far more than I need. Yeah. We can debate whether or not that excess is necessary, but we can't debate whether or not it exists. Yeah. <laughs> I'm glad I'm in this run. This is a good run. Ah, uh, I screwed that up. Well, we're gonna try and go to the Abbey of the True Gun now as well. Beautiful. Oh, party pooper. I was waiting for him to burn. <laughs> that was fucking dumb. <laughs> I don't know why I even tried that. Let's go! We are definitely hitting boss armor. Consider how much that shot hit did compared to the next two. I don't know 
know why, but I thought I was just immune to damage. Like, eh, won't happen to me. I can't let myself just get high off the memory of the good start to this run. And ignore actually playing well. So let's just try and ground ourselves for a moment. And enjoy the fact that the run is good without then throwing the run. Good thing I haven't collected the crest yet. God damn. Okay. What's in this? It's difficult not to be a cocky asshole when, when everything goes your way. Is this why rich people suck? <laughs> it's a blanket statement. I've ever made one. Um. Think we'll go with Crestfaller. All right, here we go. Got to make sure that I remember. Damn it. Good. Uh, to keep an eye on my lead skin so that I can use it anytime I'm threatened. That was really close three times over. I should have used protection there three different times. Uh, I'll purchase heart bottle. I've only got a 50% chance to steal from him successfully on this floor. And even if I do then, he'll disappear. Right. Yeah, I figured I'd be able to kill him in the next barrage, so it wasn't going to be too much of an issue that, um... Good lord, we have a lot of lead rounds summoned here. Game is really mad at me for being as powerful as I am. Not my fault my flow flows the dopest. Okay. Hey, what up, buddy? <laughs> Bully the ever loving shit out of him. See, the beautiful thing is this gun is primarily good due to reasonable damage, but mostly that it freezes the enemy. And that freezing of the enemy puts you in a really good position to deal enough damage to deal with them afterwards, you know, however you'd like. But the cool thing with the Chaos Bullets right now is... It's a really good gun external of its disabling abilities, just because it does a lot of damage. Such a good gun. We can shut you up immediately?
I just want to open the path to the Abbey of the True Gun, because I do want to go there. I actually tried to activate Lead Skin mid-roll there. Thankfully, I didn't end up getting hit. But it's another instance of midway through a roll, panicking, and then you can't activate things midway through a roll. Okay. Yep, 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 yep. No, no yipping. Let's check another one down here. With my luck, the last room that I discover this floor is going to be our shrine room. Literally the final one. You're kidding me. It's actually looking like the truth right now. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> oh well. Yep. Last one I discovered. Let's go kill the boss. I'm mad about that game, because I hit the blank button, and you fucking know it too. I wouldn't have stood that close if I was already flawless. No, game, we're not cool. We ain't like that no more. That's pretty good. I really think that's one thing the game needs to change. In certain frames of your role, you can't activate items, you can't activate blanks. Does that synergize with anything I have currently? No. Eh, whatever. Next floor still shouldn't kill me. That's pretty good, though. Thank you for being the HP that this floor didn't give me. Never mind, that's the HP this floor didn't do. <laughs> so, I forgot that was there. Good thing I went back to check. Uh, okay, we'll check the exit room. I'm, I'm still mad at what happened in this room. Honestly, it's a travity. Travity? A travity. You know, those travities that occur. Uh, it's a travesty slash tragedy, I think is what my brain was going for there. Mm-hmm. One travity? Good lord. All right, crest ball time. Crestfaller with Pox Cannon on the offhand. Of course, the big problem about coming down to this floor is... Oh, no. This is, this is me. Oh, no. I don't know if I have enough keys. But I do. I definitely, definitely do.
and pretty much always will. Thanks, Master of Unlocking. I didn't even see the bullet that got me there. But that's what they always say, you never see the one that gets you. I thought that was going to have passed me by then. Well, uh, at this rate, I'm going to die this floor in a few seconds. So that's, that's not good. I can't even protect it. One thing spawned. I was certain that was going to be it. Oh well. If you... If you had Gundrometer Strain, I would have stolen it from you so quick your head would have fucking spun off your shoulders. <laughs> oh man, it would have been glo... I have a theory. I'm gonna hold it to myself for a moment, but I think I may have just confirmed it, at least within my own brain. Sucks. Uh, it appears my theory was wrong anyway. I thought this was um, bullet hell. I thought this was the same. A lot of the rooms looked very similar to bullet hell, and I was like, oh shit, is this bullet hell before some sort of transformation? But no. Did I just get knocked away by a kill pillar up there? Get him! Got him. <laughs> Stole my ammo. I'm never gonna get uh, never going to forget about that. Hey, that's my hunt complete. Beautiful. Wasn't even thinking about that. Hey, there we go. And we refilled our crestfaller. Alright, I want to find the secret rooms on this floor, especially because one of them's a free item. Brother Albin. Jason, okay. I can open this though. Very rare to get something by itself now. From a brown chest specifically. I'm 
to wait for you to come out of your shell. So that you can get really, really annoyed by the hits I've done. There we go. Okay. I need not to miss any more flawlesses. That's the big issue I have with myself right now. Just get the damn flawlesses, Ryan. Or at the very least, if you don't get the flawlesses, complain about it endlessly. There we go, I've got both of my co uh, bases covered. Okay. Good thing I froze two of them immediately. Otherwise, I definitely would have taken damage there. Okay, this is going to be one of the secret rooms. Okay, and it is Albin. Yes, speed up. Thank you. Huge. Brother Albin, or several truths. You are holding up all of them. Speed up plus a blank? It's a blank per floor, I mean. Um. Very yes. I'm gonna tick a strong yes on the box next to do I want this? Yeah. Fuck yes. In any run that goes to the... This area forgotten his name already. Abby the True Gun. In any run that really goes to the Abby the True Gun, you're already going to win. So Abby the True Gun pretty much determines just how much you win. We now have two huge speed ups. We're at the point where I'm not so certain I could lose if I desperately wanted to. Let's try and get, um, let's get silver bullets or gilded bullets now. Oh man, that'd be fun. Silver bullets to increase my damage to all these jammed enemies, and to bosses. Increases your damage to jammed enemies by 200% or something like that, 225%. Uh, and your boss to- your damage to bosses by 25%. Gilded bullets would be 0.4% damage up per casing. Which is obviously pretty damn incredible. There's a key back there. Okay. Let's go back to the key. Entirely unnecessary, but Awesome. I can't take it. It's not... <sighs> it sucks? That I can't take it. Not, not Elder Blank. Elder Blank does not suck. It sucks that I can't take it because lead skin is so good. I was supposed to be forcing the weapon from the boss on this floor. Oh well. Beautiful. Whew.
Okay. I don't know why I thought nestling myself in there was definitely going to protect me, but I did. Of course it's that one. Why wouldn't it be that one? Alright. Uh... Good blank. Don't disappear, don't disappear. Beautiful. <clears throat> That's a flawless. We did have to be stupidly overpowered and have two blanks, but it was a flawless nonetheless. Second flawless! Uh, second time I've ever flawless that guy. <clears throat> Let's go back to Crestfall up. Got him. Oh, you, you bastard. I hate that they don't tell you that they're jammed until they open. But to be fair, they are a mimic, so, you know. They're not supposed to be up front with you. It's the whole opposite of what a mimic is. Again, I don't know what I really expected there. Yep, that happened. Go for all of these. I'm trying to knock them into the abyss, but they die first, damn it. here and then blank here sure sure Let's go 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 friends <sighs> one down two down three Oh, beautiful. I know I'm playing too quick for my own good, and I'm wasting a lot of ammo and things like that, but it's really hard not to in this run.
It's one of the most high-paced dungeon runs I've had in ages. Just due to how fast we are and how powerful we are. Uh, sure, let's go down here. And spawn here. Instant kill upon spawn. Good shit. Good shit right there, right there. That's all I really wanted to get. That guy immediately. And knock you in. Damn, this run is beautiful. All right, what shrine? Glass? Dang. I just haven't had a glass shrine yet, I really want one. Well, that was easy. We have a familiar who shoots rockets that do a bunch of damage. Should I get something that will increase his damage by 80%? Yes, definitely. At all points, yes. Now I'm just manufacturing my own screen shake. I removed it in the options, and now I'm doing it myself. I haven't picked up a gun yet this floor. I want to see if Rocket Man can one-shot things for me. Obviously, I don't get to see that yet, though. Okay. I think we're okay here. Beautiful. I did want to save as many blanks as possible for the blank shrine, but not at the cost of missing out on the HP here. Thankfully, I didn't have to choose. Double vision will have me hit boss armor with every shot I take with any weapon, so... That one's a bad idea. Drum clip in general isn't that good. Flak bullets is, though. If I recall... Hang on, let me double check flak bullets, but... If I recall, flak bullets is just, like... Effectively 30% damage up? Black. Uh, okay. 
Whenever a bullet hits an enemy or a wall, it splits into several smaller, lower damage bullets that travel outwards. Uh, different weapons have their smaller bullets do varying amount of damage. The damage of each smaller bullet is equal to the number of the sorry is equal to the damage of the original bullet divided by the number of split bullets. Typically, it splits into three, four, or seven. So if it hits, let let's say. Okay, so let's say it shoots out in four different directions. Uh, since it's exploding from a point of impact with an enemy, it's likely to hit another two of those four. So that's 50% damage up. Very, very shoddy working there, and it makes a lot of assumptions. Okay, that only hits one, so this is... With this weapon... This is basically a... Uh... One in six damage up. Whatever that turns out to be, it's that. Shut up, like you're that good at maths? <laughs> now I'm going to be shown up by someone who really is. Damn. It is really strange for me to look at my number of keys and have it be that high. Like, really strange. Hey, buddy. How you doing? I like it a lot. Radiated lead. Uh, blank there for a secret room. And then we'll just use these two here. Sure. Dang it. And final thing I want to do is Winchester challenge up here. None of those are going to adversely ch affect my chances. I want to see how this works, though. Flak bullets. Okay, flak bullets had no effect. This is one of the ones I'm really confident at. Beautiful. Now you can see why I'm so confident. Well, our speed is ridiculous. <laughs> uh, man, this is a wild time. Now let's just get clone and go back round again. Okay. Uh... These two. Okay. What we need right now is a good reason to increase our curse, so... Someone who's selling something that we can't afford and we can steal instead. It's so liberating when you actually have a run where... You don't need to buy any keys. We are so fast. Uh, it's so liberating to have a run where you don't need to buy any keys, because then you can really see how much keys cost you on an average run. Because we've been able to buy pretty much fucking anything I wanted at any point. Um... And that's mostly based on the keys. Mostly based on the fact that I didn't have to spend any money on keys. I want stout bullets, but...
Can one of you die? Jeez. I want stab bullets, but I don't know if it's the thing I want to steal right now. Because I might want to steal Patriot, who knows? That said, Patriot will definitely hit boss armor pretty much every shot. Frost elements. Frost. Frost element is what I call that. But no, Frost Amulet is going to be really good here. Going to severely increase the power level of any other blank synergies. I'm looking at you! Uh... Owl? Damn it! That was a bad roll. Should not have rolled towards. Okay. Don't know why I rolled away there. I tried to roll across. This is the problem. When the run is too good, something deep inside of you says, play badly. I don't know what it is. There's just a force deep inside of you that says, yep, yeah, throw it. Throw the good run. I do it so often with Lament Configurum runs. Uh, especially common when I play with the dungeon, although I'm not using it right now. Has happened while using Gunter, to my utter dismay. Okay, so before this patch, which sucks by the way, not this patch, but the change, uh, Apparently, there was a bug with Chaos Weapon uh, and Beam Weapons. Sorry, with Chaos Bullets and Beam Weapons. Where, if you had Chaos Bullets and Beam Weapons, you would do way too much damage. I'm annoyed I didn't get to try that out. I'll go complete one more room so I can get those stamp bullets. Funnily enough, stamp bullets is going to be a damage downgrade, but I think I might need it anyway. Specifically to be a damage downgrade to try and prevent boss armor enacting. So it's a damage upgrade when you're close to the boss, and it's damage, well, when you're close to your target, and a damage downgrade when you're further away from your target. And in boss fights, you typically tend to be further away from your target because you can't afford to take a single hit at all. Beautiful. Law oh, the enemy was already in my face then. 
Okay, and here we have what item? Guess we'll find out after we beat the enemy item. Motherfucker, you think you're gonna trick me? That's the ability to steal. I already have the ability to steal. Zero out of ten for ethic. Come back next time. Mine. <laughs> no! You took all the rest away! What am I gonna do without all of that item that I wasn't gonna buy? I think I start with Commando. Well, the flak bullets look hilarious with this. That's for sure. Yeah, I can't get closer. I do less damage if I get closer. This is ridiculous. Beautiful. <laughs> God, this is stupid. Uh, our rolls are actually going to go too far. I need to take out a different weapon. Now I can swap back to the good stuff. Look at how... Look at how much our damage slowed after the first half of that hard kill. Okay. Another HP up for us. Then we can go back here to pick up this one. Knock this over and load back up on my uh, load back up on ammunition. Hey, sure, I'll collect that too. Secret room was over here, I think. It definitely should have been. God, we're quick. I think I know where the secret room is. I just can't fucking find it right now. Was it to the left of this? No. I kind of want the Patriot. No, Ryan. Don't throw the game away because you're a huge idiot. If you're going to throw it away... Throw it away for better reasons than that. We're out of here. Uh, I'm gonna be using Hexagon just for my general safety. Keep myself the fuck away from enemies if I can. Plus we'll have a chance to hex the more complex enemies. Talking about you, jammed. What up, bullet hell? Thank you for the opportunity to embarrass myself. Going in the wrong room. No, you get the fuck out of my way. They didn't really get the hell out of my way, but it works. 
Also, cleaning my language up? Get the fuck out of my way. They didn't do that, but... Still, everything went down fine. I love that there's now a cursed chicken going around. Hey, we didn't get the respawn, okay. A lot of these rooms are just gonna be an exercise in does Rhapsody remember where the worst enemy spawns? Typically, the answer should be yes, by the way. Done this floor enough times. Uh, now I probably try and pick something else up, right? Eh, sure. The flat cannon did all the damage for that kill, by the way. Wingman's shots are getting split. That's cool as hell. Too fast for my own good. immediately into damage. I knew I was going the wrong way, but at that point there was just one more room to clear. Still not better defensively than this though. Look how this map fills with projectiles as soon as we use this weapon. I love it. Black bullets are insane. Um, I'm going to be using this gun as much as I can really afford to here. Just so that I can get use out of it while I'm trying to force it to generate its weapon. It's also just turning out to be a solid weapon right now. That's tempting, but I'm not going to refill it. Yep! I should have figured that. Up here. Come on, up here. Thank you. Oh, that's actually really good. If you're wondering how I'm firing so fast right now, I was for a second as well, and then I realized I'm actually rolling, reloading a lot of my shots right now. Like, shot, re, shot, shot. It's really cool. Anyhow, I should go to the sling. I didn't even see myself get a hit there.
There we go. That's the kind of attack pattern I was waiting for, buddy. <laughs> uh, no need to have waited for that attack pattern, by the way. Alright. Off to the commando. I'm too fast! Okay, and... All through! Are we done here? Yep! Pretty successfully done now. Okay. Eh, I'm not gonna go with that one. Oh, what? I didn't think he was close enough to the center of the map, initially. So I didn't think he was gonna get that attack off in that time. Uh, let's go with Snubnose for the final bit of the kill. I want to try and kill with weapons I've never killed with before. Now that's a pretty ridiculously overpowered run right there. Chaos Bullets on the first floor along with Master of Unlocking. Master of Unlocking, Chaos Bullets, uh, Lead Skin, and the... Air tank. Compressed air tank. All on the first floor. Insanity. Ruthless insanity. I think Chaos Bullets was C tier as well, or was it B tier? Uh, sorry, was it uh, blue chest or green chest? I'm gonna quickly check that, actually. Uh, Chaos Bullets. Oh no, it's not Chaos Bullets, it's uh, Curse Bullets. Cursed bullets. C! Okay, so it actually is blue tier. That's hilarious. Stupid amount of items, stupid amount of speed ups and HP ups and amulets, and it's all good. My name has been Rhapsody. I just slapped my microphone. I'm sorry about that. Hopefully, you've been enjoying yourselves, and hopefully, we'll see you <laughs> next time.